Hey y'all, it's Liz. How are you? Hey look, um, I had a request when I did my um, lipstick palettes to um, tell the colors of the lipstick. First of all, I'm not wearing any lipstick right now. It's just a gloss and it's this um, Focus on Lips. And y'all, it tastes just like peppermint. Like a peppermint patty. But that's what it is. It's a mint gloss. <laughs> but anyways, I got this along with these three. This is the Focus on Lips um, uh, Lip Heal. It's a scrubber. I just want to show you these before I go into anything else. It's got a tip on it that scrubs my lips. And it's got a cream base that comes up and it helps exfoliate your lips. I got this. And then I got the... Um, this is the collagen. Um, it helps plump up your lips. And it looks like that. And you just press it. And the products... Don't press it too hard because it should have flop out. And then what you gonna do? But anyways, the products come comes out of it. And you just kind of glide this on your lips. Like so. And... It's supposed to help plump up your lips. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to see any of that as far as it plumping up my lips. I just be out like this. <sighs> That's a lot of gloss on my lips now. And then I got the um, the mint one. This was a dollar and forty nine cents at CVS because it's on clearance. And this was a dollar sixty nine, and this was a dollar ninety nine. So I went ahead and I got these three. And then I, because I had a $5 coupon also. So, yahoo for me. Okay, let me get, get some of that off of there because that's just really like too much. Okay, so someone had asked the names of the lipsticks that I had depotted in my little palette. This is going to be, I named this my toast palette. And the colors inside are as followed. This is Amber. This is Majestic Mauve. This is number 547B. And this one is Hazelnut. Okay. Then in my grape palette, um, this one here is Flamboyant. This one is Divine. This one is Vava Violet. And this one is 521A. I love my grape palette because they have such pretty colors in them. This is my brown palette, or at least I named it a brown palette. This is Chocolate Velvet. This is Femme Fire, Femme, Femme Fire. This is Cafe, and this is Visionary. Out of the Magenta palette, I've got um, this one is Stormy Pink. I can't read upside down apparently. Stormy Pink, Magenta Rose, which is this one. This is called Blue Rose, and this one is called Blossom. This um, this Blue Rose is by all means one of my favorite colors. And the, um, this one is Blossom, and I'll show you that one right quick, because it's really pretty. That's Blossom. They look alike, but this one is darker. This one is darker. Um, and this one is called Magenta Rose. These are my palettes, and that's why I'm putting my fingers in them. That's Magenta Rose. It's a real sheer, with just a hint of color. And this one is called Stormy Pink, which looks like that. I love, I love these colors. They're so pretty, really pretty colors for your lips. Um, and stained fingers. The next one is my Winter Berry is what I named this palette. And let me show you the colors in here. This is uh, Curtain Call. This one is Wild Winter Berry. 
This one is uh, called Wannabe. And this one is called Poodle Skirt. Which, let me just go ahead and swatch these right quick. This is Poodle Skirt. That's Poodle Skirt. This is Wannabe. This is called Curtain Call. And this one is Wild Winter Berry, which looks like that. Real pretty colors. Okay. Them off. I made spaghetti for dinner. I had watched um, Bargain Junkie 69's video, and she had did a spaghetti dinner. And guess what, Miss Kim? I did it too. I did your recipe, and girl, it is off the chain. I am going to put Bargain Junkies um, 69's link down below, because if you want to see how to make the spaghetti sauce, it was so good. It had, it was delicious. It was delicious. So, my next color, I just had to throw that in there real quick at y'all. This is my pinks, and let's see. This one is called Pink Frost. This one is called Lilac. This one is called Chiffon, and this one is called Paparazzi Pink. Do you want me to swatch them? Okay. <laughs> Let's start with this one. This one is called um, Lilac. That's Lilac. This one is called Pink Frost, which is a very sheer color. This one is called Chiffon which is like a chiffon color. It's a real creamy with an iridescent of pearl-like. I did that really well, didn't I? Like pearl. And this last one is called Pink Frost. No. Paparazzi Pink. I already did Pink Frost. Let me wipe that off. Paparazzi Pink, which is this one. Okay. It's my pink palette. White and colors up my fingers. Now I'm going in with the berry colors. Okay. We have Persistent Plum, Lilac Frost, Plumalicious, and a Dusty Rose. So this is Persistent Plum, which is this color here. Persistent Plum. Lilac Frost is this one. So this is kind of sheer too. Um, plum, Plumalicious, which is this one. Oh, did, you, did I use the finger now? This is Plumalicious. And the last one is a Dusty Rose, which is that color right there. Okay. Real pretty colors. So if I just want to go kind of light with just a hint of color, I can use several of those because they're like that. You know, they're kind of sheer, but they got just a hint of color to it. This is my mauve palette. This one is called Love It Sugared Maple. The New Pink. Couture Suede. So, Love It is that color right. I got stuff on my finger. Hold on, y'all. I'm sorry. Just got. Mm. <laughs> Love It. Sugar Mapled. Sugared Maple. Couture Suede. And the new pink. Which, like I said, just gives you a, a, just a hint of color. That's that one. And my last one is the copper colors. Y'all, I don't know colors. I just be writing shit on like copper and berry and stuff like that. But anyways, these are not by any means copper 
We got orange. <laughs> Go figure. Orange. Gold Rush. Sheer Pout and Raisin. So let me show you these. Let's start with Sheer Pout. Do that on my pinky right here. That Sheer Pout. It looks sheer, don't it? Got a little... Look like an eyeliner shit on my finger. I don't know what the hell's up with that. Okay. There. That Sheer Pout. This is Raisin. Which... Raisin is a, a really neutral brown color. Might as well slap that on there too. And then we have Gold Rush, which looks like this. Just dug my finger in that. That's Gold Rush. It's just a real pretty color. And this is orange. There wasn't a name, it just said orange. And that's orange. So. I just put different colors on. Gold Rush and Orange. Yeah. So that's it for those. And that's the ones that I had done. Uh, somebody did ask to, for me to do the names of them. And that's what I did. And I hope you guys are happy. Um, yeah. Uh, let me show you one more thing. Got to get my shoe on. Hold on. Okay, I'm back, and I'm sorry about that. I know I'm taking up a lot of your time, but hey, deal with it. Okay, as you know, um, before I did those in the little um, e.l.f. palettes, I do have these still that I do use. These are my lipsticks, and they're in Towers. comes in this plastic case, which I got from the, the craft section at Walmart. Very inexpensive, and it came with these jars. So let me show you. I've got them stackable. They're stackables. So let's say I wanted to take this color and this color and replace it with these two. All I would do is unscrew them. Just like so. And I would screw it onto this one. And now I've got my thing back, and I can put these together because I don't want to take these. I wanted to take these. So there, you could just kind of adjust it the way you want to and then take them with you on vacation. Um, I would rather slide this into my, my uh, makeup bag or one of these palettes, either one. Um, the way I did these, the same concept. The same exact items I used to melt down the lipstick, I used, but instead of a spoon, I used a metal measuring cup. The little small ones, they come stacked. I used the smallest one, and I just put it over the fire, and I melted it, and then I poured it inside. I just poured it inside of this and let it sit by, you know, just let it sit by itself until it he dried, until it healed until it hardened up. This one is NYX's Baby Pink, by the way. Um, but yeah, that's how I did it. It was the same concept. And um, so yeah, that's how that works. You gotta figure, put them back together again, lizard. Was it these? Y'all got me messed up. Oh, that one doesn't go there, Liz. That goes like this. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just getting confused here. Three, four, five. Okay. And then this goes with this one. Put that back in there. This goes back over here. <laughs> Yeah, so someone had asked about this one, too, because I, they knew I had, they, they couldn't remember exactly, you know, I know that you made another palette for lipstick, and they're in here, and I got two of them, um, 
this is um these are I really do like these colors. These are some of my favorites. This is a show orchid orchard orchid show orchid orchard. It's this one here. And like I said, all you do, I I like using um, brushes to apply my lipsticks. After I line up my lips with the magenta, I'll just take this and uh, and apply it. Yeah, like y'all really need to freaking see that. I just want to show it to you anyways. These are some of my favorite colors here. And if I just want to take a couple of them, I'll just take them out and screw it on to the other ones that I want. And then I just take them with me. So yeah, those are two ways of organizing your lipsticks that you're depotting in this. Because it holds uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. There's like 30. You can get like 30 of them in here. And you can get four in each one of these. But these are really convenient just to throw in your purse. This. Or you could take out a couple of these and throw them in your purse. Uh, it's all good. Okay. Well, I just wanted to show you guys that. Um, you guys have a great day. And I'll be talking to you real soon. Alright. This is y'all. Bye.